All right, here's a little bit of uh, late round running back advice, okay? So by the time I had my first two running backs, Le'Veon Bell and uh, Christian McCaffrey, I had to pick up a bunch of wide receivers. So we have to start two running backs, two wide receivers. We get one running back on the bench. So that's the difficulty here, all right? So all these running backs, all these starting running backs are gone. You got all the way down to, you know, Ingram and Abdullah and C.J. Anderson and Crowell, Doug Martin, obviously, suspension. Not a lot left. Now, this dude, McFadden, that was uh, that was who I was uh, gunning for. And I recommend if you're in a league where you have two running backs starting and one on the bench, I would pick up McFadden. You're going to get him for the first five games because, you know, Elliott is suspended. So McFadden's going to be the starter. So you're going to have a great starter. There's a great line. He's going to get hurt maybe, but, you know, that's what you have to do with your third running back. You have to start to anticipate starters getting hurt. Uh, or or you go with a committee and hope that your guy is the one that doesn't get hurt because that's what, you know, running backs get hurt. That's what happens. So what I did was I couldn't believe it, but Tevin Coleman was still out there. Tevin Coleman is in a set with uh, Devontae Freeman, I'm sure you know, with Atlanta Devontae's first and second down, Coleman's third down. So he's going to get touchdowns anyway, but Freeman's already got an injury. He's already starting the season a little bit uh, banged up. So eventually he's going to go down, and Coleman's going to be the primary in a couple games this year at least. So I figure I'd pick him up, put him on my bench. I don't really need him <clears throat> until week nine because Le'Veon Bell's out week nine. If, you know, assuming Bell doesn't get hurt. But it's nice to have somebody like that on the bench. So I'm. I'm saying to you guys, target in the later rounds, in the later rounds, I'm guessing like ninth round. He went in the eighth round here. This is really weird. But I would take McFadden in Dallas. I would take Coleman in Atlanta. Those are my top two picks for the your bench, your first bench running back.